The Spring Mountain Ranch State Park is located just north of the tribal village and very close to Bonnie Springs, which uh, is one of my favourite locations of the game. It evolves over time. You know, there's, first there's Vipers, then there's Cazadors, and maybe a Blind Deathclaw if you're lucky. That's pretty cool. Yeah, well, back to the state park, we have some mantises. Giant ones that are pretty easy to just smash. There's also a few big horners that you can take care of. And inside here, I've been told that there is... There's a dresser we can loot. I don't... Oh, is that it? Is that the dresser? It is. That's it. That is that is the notable loot in this area. It's a pretty expansive part of uh, the Mojave. You can go up around that wee ridge. And it gives you a bit of a, a back entrance to uh, Red Rock Canyon. I don't really know who would use that. Because the Great Cans aren't hostile, they're pretty friendly unless you are fighting them. So maybe for certain people, it might make sense. That burned house over there also contains the unmarked Great Can Armory, which is quite useful too. Uh, the only other wee insight I have to this... Oh, if you go up that way, I think that leads you up to the tribal village as well. They're all sort of connected through wee canyon passes uh, to get to these locations. This is the real-life Spring Mountain Ranch State Park location. This, You know, it is mimicked on the real life location which is pretty cool and yeah short and sweet that's just the way i like it sometimes uh i've seen that big horner glitching out there i'll hit a big horner and call it an episode be sure to drop a like if you're enjoying the content comment if you want to join in the conversation and uh see you all in the next one. Oh. Ooh. hey you for watching